Hi friends, I'm Nageshwa. Welcome to my channel ITBot143. You are watching Microsoft Office Excel 2007 tutorials. In this tutorial, I will show you how to record and use macros in MS Excel. When we are working with Excel, some process can be repetitive. Suppose that every month we are creating a report with sales of various employees following the same format. For this, no need to create again and again. Instead of this, in Excel, we can record a macro which is an action or a set of actions that we can run as many times as we want with a single click. Here I have created data about employee sales for 6 months. I want to add rows for sales of various items and also including the total sales row and applying the same process to other employees also. No need to enter the data again and again. For this we can create a macro. Before this to work with macros we need to enable developer tab. Click on office button. Select Excel options. In popular tab, select Show Developer tab in the ribbon and click OK. Now we will get the Developer tab on the menu ribbon. Click on this. After this, select the first cell and click on Record Macro. Before this, better to click on Use Relative References. If you don't select to Use Relative References, always it will run the macro from first cell only. Now click on Record Macro. Select a name for your macro items and we can also create a shortcut key to run this but remember that you should not conflict with other shortcut keys in excel i want to use ctrl shift n as shortcut key so press shift n simultaneously now it is showing the entire shortcut key select a location for the macro we can select a personal macro workbook new workbook or this workbook i'm keeping it as default and also we can enter any description after that click ok now the macro is recording our activity. I want to add 4 rows below first row and enter items name. And below item 4 I want to show total. Now let's add a auto sum formula. For that come to home menu, click on auto sum, select the cell references and hit enter. Apply this to all the months by dragging horizontally. And if you want we can also format this. Now I want to apply this process to all the employees. For that again come to developer tab, click on stop recording. After this select the first cell of another employee, click on macros in developer tab. Here it will show all the macros. Select the macro you want to run and click on run. And we got the same thing that we prepared in macro. No need to type again and again. Item details and the total value. Let's use the shortcut key. Select the first cell and press Ctrl Shift N. It will run the macro again and again and shows the result. Here I have another example. I have prepared a format with student marks and notice that I forgot to add some formula. For this let's create a macro. Select the first cell, click on record macro, enter a macro name, select a shortcut key, ok. Here let's insert a new row and type total. Select the other cell, come to home menu, click on auto sum and press enter. Apply this to all the subjects. Click and drag horizontally. And let's format this. After completing the process, again come to developer tab. Click on stop recording. Select the other student first cell. Click on macros. Select the macro you want to add. Click on run. And let's use the shortcut key. Ctrl Shift L. Notice that by running this macro, it inserted a new row and applied the auto sum formula and if you want to create a button for your macro for that click on arrow below insert from the drop down list select the first option button click and drag anywhere then it will open assign macro window select the macro you want to add this to the button i'm selecting sum click ok after this click in one cell and to apply the macro click on macro button and automatically it will apply the macro. Like this we can record and use macros in Microsoft Office Excel 2007. I hope you like this video. If you like this video please click on like button and please share this video with your friends and please visit my channel ITBot143 
to watch more latest uploaded videos and don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you friends have a nice day